Welcome to Liturgy of the Hours with Deacon Kevin. This is a ministry of St. Joseph's Catholic Church in Jacksonville, Florida. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Father, we thank you who has planted your holy name within our hearts knowledge and faith and life immortal jesus your son to us imparts you lord did make all for thy pleasure did give man food for all his days giving in christ the bread eternal yours is the power be yours the praise watch o'er your church o lord in mercy save it from evil guard it still perfect it in your love unite it cleansed and conformed unto your will as grain once scattered on the hillsides was in this broken bread made one so from all lands your church be gathered into your kingdom by your son day after day i will bless you lord i will tell of your marvelous deeds i will give you glory o god my king i will bless your name forever I will bless you day after day and praise your name forever. The Lord is great, highly to be praised. His greatness cannot be measured. Age to age will proclaim your works, shall declare your mighty deeds, shall speak of your splendor and glory, tell the tale of your wonderful works. They will speak of your terrible deeds, recount your greatness and might. They will recall your abundant goodness age to age shall ring out your justice the lord is kind and full of compassion slow to anger abounding in love how good is the lord to all compassionate to all his creatures all your creatures shall thank you o lord and your friends shall repeat their blessing they shall speak of the glory of your reign and declare your might o god to make known to all your mighty deeds and the glorious splendor of your reign. Yours is an everlasting kingdom. Your rule lasts from age to age. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Day after day I will bless you, Lord. I will tell of your marvelous deeds. To you alone, Lord, we look with confidence. You are ever close to those who call upon you. The Lord is faithful in all his words and loving in all his deeds. The Lord supports all who fall and raises up all who are bowed down. The eyes of all creatures look to you and you give them their food in due time. You open wide your hand, grant the desires of all who live. The Lord is just in all his ways and loving in all his deeds. He is close to all who call him, who call on him from their hearts. He grants the desires of those who fear him. He hears their cry and he saves them. The Lord protects all who love him, but the wicked he will utterly destroy. Let me speak the praise of the Lord. Let all peoples bless his holy name forever for ages unending glory to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and will be forever amen lord be near to all who call upon you in truth and increase the dedication of those who revere you hear their prayers and save them that they may always love you and praise your holy name to you alone, Lord, we look with confidence. You are ever close to those who call upon you. King of all the ages, your ways are perfect and true. Mighty and wonderful are your works, Lord God Almighty. Righteous and true are your ways, O King of the nations. Who would dare refuse you honor or the glory do your name, O Lord? Since you alone are holy, all nations shall come and worship in your presence. Your mighty deeds are clearly seen. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. King of all the ages, your ways are perfect and true. There is no condemnation now from those who are in Christ Jesus. The law of the Spirit, the Spirit of life in Christ Jesus, has freed you from the law of sin and death. If Christ is in you, the body is dead because of sin, while the Spirit lives because of justice. If the Spirit of Him who raised Jesus from the dead dwells in you, then He who raised Christ from the dead will bring your mortal bodies to life also, through His Spirit dwelling in you. Christ died for our sins to make of us an offering to God. Christ died for our sins to make of us an offering to God. He died to this world of sin and rose in the power of the Spirit to make of us an offering to God. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Christ died for our sins to make of us an offering to God. Remember your mercy, Lord, the promise of mercy you made to our fathers. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm and has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham, and to his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Remember your mercy, Lord, the promise of mercy you made to our fathers. Let us pray to Christ, the source of all hope for all who know his name. Lord, have mercy. Christ, our frail humanity is prone to fall. Strengthen us through your help. Left to itself, our nature is inclined to sin. Let your love always restore it to grace. Lord, sin offends you, repentance pleases you. Do not punish us in your wrath, even when we have sinned. You forgave the penitent woman and placed the wandering sheep on your shoulders. Do not deprive us of your mercy. By your death on the cross you opened the gates of heaven. Admit into your kingdom all who hoped in you. Let us make our prayers and praise complete by offering the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God our Father, you brought salvation to all mankind through the suffering of Christ your Son. May your people strive to offer themselves to you as a living sacrifice and be filled with the abundance of your love. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks be to God.